Here we have the intakes with the e jar system on top, but the intakes, common problem on them, first of all, you have all of the buildup here, as you can see, from the e jar gas coming back uh, to the intakes, and of course, you have all of carbon buildup right here, as you can see, it's, it's bad. So we gotta clean all of this, of course, before we gotta install the intakes. But while I have the intakes out, I just wanna show you kind of a not nice design of a Mercedes-Benz. Um, the runners, what moves those flaps over here, they are plastic. And as you can see, um, once once the vehicle sit for, once, once you drive it every day, you should not have a problem. But once this thing will sit for a month or two, due to all of this buildup, it's gonna become almost like stone and it's gonna get clogged here. Then the motor, the electrical motor, what's right here, will try to move those plastic arms. And usually what happens, they break because this thing is stuck here. Um, and, or you will have, as you can see, a loose like this in here. This thing will become more and more, and then this thing will not close properly and you will get a full coat for the intakes being stuck. Uh, so that's another thing um, that you might see on a 642 engine, which is a really common problem.